how to create an ebook just like this. Hey, what's up, guys? So, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can create your very own ebook. I've been getting a lot of questions since the last video um, about the free gifts that I showed in the system but I all video. Um, I've been getting a lot of questions. How do you create your own ebook? So in this video, I'll show you how to create your very own ebook, how to get, uh, how to get this awesome cover and how to share your ebook. All right, so let's get started. First, we'll go to canva.com and just search up ebook cover. This will give you all templates already pre-made you can look up on the left your themes and your category or niche. The we'll find one that's in your niche. I ended up doing the affiliate marketing blueprint on one of these templates. So I ended up picking this one down here. And uh, you can remove the paid items. I won't go over how I edited and made the first cover photo, but you can, you can make it your own uh, with one of these templates. So this one here again, this is the one I ended up using. So I, I based it off. Um, I based it off this one. Removed the paid version images, kept the text, and removed the world because that was also a paid version. And I added a new logo of the world that was free, and I kind of made it my own. Perfect. So once you edit your cover photo, simply download it on Canva, then head over to this website, DIYBookCovers.com. You can go on book design here, 3D mockups. Click on this, and then you can have your single covers, or you can have a composite with multiple. I ended up using this one right here because it was showing the pages and not the spine. Um, if you do the spine one, you need to add an, an additional photo for the spine, and I just didn't want to make another spine photo. Anyway, you just select this one, hit next, browse and upload your photo. And you have to upload it like this twice. It'll upload like that. Then you'll hit next. Then it'll give you these two buttons at the bottom. And you can choose your version. You can download the PNG version or the JPEG version. Perfect. Once downloaded, that will look like this. Now you have your nice looking professional ebook cover. I like to use Google Docs instead of Word because this is online on my drive. And I can simply share this with um, with everyone that has the link. I'll show you how to how to set that up. And I can keep making changes to this. Uh, so when people view it later, they can see the changes where in Word in a Word file. Once it's finished and sent, that's how it is, and you can update it. Okay. So in my ebook, I just uploaded the cover photo that we just made on the first page and have the title. And then I added these little headers and footers. And uh, you, can, you can follow the link in my bio or profile to get this free ebook. And then you can copy it. Well, you can't exactly copy it. You can, you can copy it and change the text to make it work for you. I ended up making these uh, two more images on Canva as well about a 21 by 4 centimeter photo and you can create your custom designs here with custom size and then you can choose centimeters and then do your width and height so we'll just create a header and a footer and then you can just drag and drop them in here then you just write your content if it's for affiliate marketing you can kind of go like this if it's uh, for for diet you can write your own ebook you can go to the PL, PLR website, this website, buyqualityplr.com. You can find an ebook that's in your niche or category, download it it's for free, and then take some context from there, like from this book and from this book, make it into your own and add it into your own um, ebook. Then you can keep on adding pages and content, and you want to make sure that you do a good job and not just slap stuff together quickly. Do a good job and take your time 
like this. Then once you're all done, what you want to do is you can just go hit the share button up here, file and then share, and share with others. And you can just select this from restricted to anyone with the link, copy the link, and we'll show I'll show you the next step. Okay, so you copy that link. The next step is you have to create your funnel. So I am using ClickFunnels in this example. Uh, you can also use System.io, which I had shown you in the video before. Um, if you're using, if you are using ClickFunnels, you can clone this funnel. I'll leave a link um, below if it's on. If you're watching on YouTube, if you're watching on Facebook, just leave a comment below, and I can send you the clone for this, and then it'll copy the exact clone. You just change out your image with yours, and then the email setting for yours. So we just create a quick funnel landing page. It's very simple. It's your page, and then the opt-in, and then some text, something about you. If you're using, if you're using Click Funnels, you want to make sure you click on the settings, integrations, and make sure you are connected to your autoresponder. I'm using Get Response, so I am connected. If you're using system.io, make sure you add your email campaign to the funnel. And I think I showed that in the video, in the last video with system.io. Not, I am making a new, another video with how to set up your first email campaign using system.io. And that's all the free versions. If you're using ClickFunnels and you want this, and if you're using ClickFunnels and you want to clone this exact funnel, just leave a comment below or check the description below and I'll leave a link below. This is how this funnel works. Um, you'll just go to this to my link up here. This page comes up and if you get the free ebook, you just simply enter your name and email, hit the free download and it'll transfer you to the next page. It'll add you to my email list and then it'll add you to the next page where on the second page, um, I give them one more upsell, so to speak. Um, here I can link them to my first offer. If you're doing diet, you can link them here to your first offer. If you're doing affiliate marketing, you can link them here to your first offer. And that way you can email them the book, but you also have a second page where you can already offer them something. Okay, so again, in this example, I'll be showing how to do it with GetResponse. And it's very similar with System.io, but I just, I'm just using GetResponse in this example. But you just create your first autoresponder, and after you've linked it to your ClickFunnels, you can create your autoresponder, and this is the first one on day one. So my first message on day one, when someone signs up, fills out the email in the form, they get this email. This is the first email uh, that sends it, that gets sent out. This is the first email that gets sent out right after signing up. And in this first email, and I will include the link for the Google document. This is how they get the document. They fill out the form, they sign up to my email, they check their email, and in the email is the link to the Google Docs where they can view it. This is how I created my ebook, how I shared it, and I used ClickFunnels for my landing page. If you have any questions, leave them below. This was a very quick video, so I hope it made sense. Uh, again, if you have any questions, just leave them below. Thanks. Till next time.